is Kara, AKA the Principal Painter, and today I have an exciting unboxing for you. This is a Diamond Art Club sneak peek. Yes, I just got it. I am so excited about this diamond painting. Um, as you can see from the blue bands, it is a square. Um, it is an amazing painting. When I saw the picture, the image of it, I had to have it. Thank you so much, Diamond Art Club, for sending this to me. Again, I am thrilled with this design. Um, it's not something I would normally do, but I absolutely love it. What did I get? What did I get? Are you ready? This one is called Freedom by Kim Penner. It is of a beautiful horse. There are horses off in the distance, the mountains, the trees. It is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it is a square diamond painting. They've been putting out some more rounds, but this one is a square. It's a 65 by 87 centimeter, and it is phenomenal. The way you tell, obviously, that it is a square diamond painting kit is by the blue band, and obviously it's got a square here and says square diamonds. If you get a round kit, it's gonna be pink. The circle is gonna be pink, and it will say round diamonds. But let's get into this. I'm super excited. Also, if you notice on the side of the box, there is a QR code that you can scan to get 10% off. There are many, many ways that you can get money off uh, Diamond Art Club's uh, paintings. They do not want you to pay full price for their paintings. If you look on your invoice, there will be a code there. Uh, there are codes everywhere. Oh, I cannot wait to see this. This is absolutely beautiful. If you are a horse lover, I've always loved horses. I've not, oop, I've not been an equestrian. I haven't ridden horses a whole lot. I have ridden horses, but uh, nothing else in the box. Um, but I have always been a horse lover. All right, in your box, you get this awesome logbook sticker. It is a sticker. You can peel it off, put it in a logbook, put it on your crafting table, or put it on the side of your box if you store your paintings in your box so you can tell uh, what it is. I love this because it has the full description of the painting. It's got the title, the artist, the diamond shape, and the dimensions. Again, this is a 65 by 87 centimeter. All right. I believe that we are getting now on a regular basis these new toolkits. Um, I've not seen an old toolkit in a long time, so I think they've just about wrapped up sending out their old toolkits for these new toolkits with lots more sussies in it. Let's see what we got. All right. Uh, it does come in a reusable and recyclable heavy-duty Ziploc, so you could store things in here. Uh, it's a great, great toolkit bag. All right, in your new toolkit, you get uh, a bag of baggies. Uh, either you can kit up with these or store spare drills in them. All right, you do get a pair of branded tweezers. The difference between round toolkit or round toolkits and square toolkits is in the square toolkits, you do get these tweezers. They are the pointy stabby kind so please keep the sheath on them keep them away from young children and do not poke your eyeball out uh you get ooh, i've not seen this color this is a beautiful turquoisey pen you get uh, they do put different colors of pens in here when you get a new toolkit i just want to uh, put this disclaimer out out here um, some of the things will be the same uh, as my toolkit but some will be different the color of the pen may be different the cover minder may be different uh the washi tape may be different uh, but that's okay. Um, variety is the spice of life, as they say. So you put the squishy on your pen for diamond painting comfort. Wow, it's not fighting with me too much here. All right, you get a single placer on one side. You get uh, two multi-placers. I believe, yep, always the four and the seven placer. So if you want to place more drills down at the same time, you can certainly do that. Just stick it in the other end of your pen, whether you want the four or the seven. You can even change them out. So that's very, very nice. I love this color. I haven't seen this color before. That's exciting. All right, you get washi tape. Washi tape is kind of like painter's tape, only it's decorative and you can use it to section off your diamond painting. You can use it on the perimeter of your diamond painting if the glue comes out a little bit past the image so you don't get all fuzzies in it. So that's really pretty. It's uh, some flowers. Actually, that will go beautifully with the scene. Look at this cover minder. You get a darling cover minder. Uh, this one is a beautiful golden butterfly cover minder. You will see there is a sheet of plastic on the top of this diamond painting when I take it out of the bag. When you are diamond painting, you peel your plastic back, you stick these, this beautiful cover minder on the top of your painting, 
The magnet goes on the bottom and it holds your plastic back so it is not flippy floppying around. So that is beautiful. All right, you will get these two items in every new toolkit. This is a beautiful tray, uh, diamond painting tray with a spout. It's got, this is a clear, uh, you may get clear or you may get opaque, but you can see those beautiful gold flecks. You also get a stopper. So when you are diamond painting, your drills do not flippy flop or flippy flop, do not fly out of the tray. You can take your stopper out and then pour them back into the container that you had them in. Uh, that makes it really, really easy. So I love these sparkly trays. You also get a caddy full of pink wax. In your caddy, you get two of Diamond Art Club's famous heart-shaped wax. Remember, there is plastic on the top and the bottom, so peel that plastic back or you will get no wax in your pen. And I like the caddy because it helps keep your wax from drying out. So that is awesome. So that's the toolkit. Are you ready? Let's get into this. I absolutely love this painting for so many reasons. Okay, so these canvases, very soft and buttery on the back. They are poured glue, which means you can roll them back. They do have a scalloped and surged edge uh, to prevent fraying. I've never had a problem with a Diamond Art Club canvas ever. So what I'm gonna do, because this is poured glue, I'm gonna roll it back. It is pretty pliable, actually very pliable. And this is a big one, but it's not like, ginormous um, it will be uh, it will be perpendicular not horizontal so I'm going to roll it back and zhuzh, 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 park it under my arm while I show you the other components of this kit you do get this amazing sticker sheet I love this this entire thing is a sticker um, you can cut out pieces of it and put them in log books or wherever you'd like to, to note your start and end date. There's a beautiful, look at this image guys, look at it. It is absolutely gorgeous. It has the title, I love the title, Freedom. Uh, the artist Kim Penner and down at the bottom it shows you your shape and your dimensions. All of these uh, stickers over here are individual so you can peel them off and stick them right on your containers. It has the it has your uh, number of uh, colors. There are 48 colors in this kit. So uh, I'm uh, obviously a lot of nature colors, gonna be a lot of browns in here, uh, just beautiful. And guess what guys, there are five, count them five ABs. Uh, if you look over here, and in the center of these stickers, you've got the symbols of uh, that, that will be on your canvas that correspond with the colors that you were to put down. And then you've got um, on the far right, your DMC number. So ABs, I will tell you what ABs are in just a moment while I'm showing you the drills. Um, we got 105, we got 120, we got 134, we got 138 and we got 139. If this number again is under 150, that's going to be an A, B drill. Oh, five of them. I cannot wait to see them. Um, also on the bottom, you have some blank individual stickers that you can peel back and uh, label, you know, label them what you wish and uh, you can put those uh, wherever you'd like. So that's that. Are you ready to see this? Oh wait, one more thing to show you. Sorry, hate to keep you in suspense, but it will be worth the wait, I promise. This is a brochure that Diamond Art Club sends you with every single kit. Uh, it's a thank you, thank you for your purchase, what's included in your kit. Um, take a look, uh, they've got two QR codes. One uh, up top here shows you a video on how to diamond paint. If you're a visual learner like me, that's very helpful. The bottom QR code takes you to the VIP Facebook group. If you have not joined Diamond Art Club's VIP Facebook group, I highly, highly recommend it. You get all kinds of uh, information and uh, sneak peeks of, of different things uh, in that group. So uh, please join the VIP Facebook group. Also, if you join the VIP Facebook group, there are, uh, co uh, again, discount codes in that group. Here we go, step-by-step -step instructions. You have tips and tricks, and you also have another coupon code down here. Thank you, 10, for your purchase. And uh, these two QR codes on the back are for an iPhone or an Android uh, to download the Diamond Art Club app. I do have that app on my phone. If you have not downloaded that app, I highly recommend it. And whether you are a new or an old customer, 
uh, when you download the app, your first purchase after you've downloaded the app, you get 20% off of a Diamond Art Club. So that is awesome. So if you've not downloaded the Diamond Art Club app, I highly recommend. All right, the moment we have all been waiting for. Are we ready? Look at this. If you are a horse lover, I absolutely see no reason why you should not get this. Uh, these paintings, I'm sorry I haven't mentioned this before, these paintings will come out tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock Pacific and 12 o'clock Eastern. And uh, that's, that's your time zones. Uh, so the 9 o'clock and 12 o'clock uh, times are for Diamond and Ruby members. Those are levels that you can achieve at Diamond Art Club, uh, depending on how many purchases you've made. Um, and then 30 minutes later, at 9.30 Pacific and 11.30 Eastern, these will come out for the general public. Guys, if you are a nature lover, if you are a horse lover, I suggest you get your hands on this. It is absolutely gorgeous. This will be done and be hung in my house. Um, I absolutely love it. And it's big enough to where you can see the detail. The musculature in this horse is phenomenal. I absolutely love it love this image. Look at the face on that horse. Just so serene and peaceful. Just like the horse walked up to you and he's just looking at you. All right, I'm going to peel this plastic back so you can see the canvas is extremely sticky. Not a problem in the world with it. Uh, if Marlon can pan you into this drill field so you can see the symbols are extremely clear. I have never had a blurry symbol on a Diamond Art Club ever. Um, again, these symbols are as clear as a bell, uh, always are. Oh, I just, guys, I love this image. And Marlon's going to take um, the phone off the tripod and go over the entire canvas for you because you probably can't see the whole thing. But we will take time to uh, show you the entire canvas. Again, 48 colors in this uh, beautiful, beautiful painting. I love this one. I absolutely love this one. Looks like maybe they're in Colorado, New Mexico, um, who knows. All right, I'm gonna put that plastic down. If you see what appears to be rivers, bubbles, it's just the plastic. Uh, there's never any, I've never had a problem with a Diamond Art Club and believe me, I've gotten a ton of them. And so that's what that is, it's just the plastic. All right, now that you have kind of, I mean, this, this painting makes me feel so peaceful. It's just absolutely stunning. I just love it. Wow, there's nothing I don't like about this at all. Okay, let me flip this over and we will look at the drills. Remember guys, I do take more time on these sneak peeks for you so you can see every aspect of the canvas and the drills. Let's get in here. All right, lots of drills. Remember, there are 58 colors, no, 48 colors. So here we go. And again, lots of nature colors that are gonna be in here. And it is a square. I haven't done a square diamond art club in a while. All right, three bags of 402. Can they see these okay? Mm -hmm. All right, 3826. Four bags of 38, no, five bags of 3826. You are gonna have a lot of browns and a lot of nature colors in this, obviously, with that horse and the mountains and everything else. All right, ding, 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 ring the AB bell. This is our first AB. It is a uh, tan color, and if they can see that coating, Marlin, what is an AB drill, Kara? AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is a special coating put on the drills that capture the facets of light, capture the colors of the drills around it, and all together now just makes them shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer, just a little bit more. So again, you can compare, you see that coating that's catching the, I mean, I'm seeing purples and yellows in that coating, and these are shiny. Believe me, Diamond Art Club drills are fantastic, second to none, and they're very shiny, but this coating just makes those drills shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer. Here we go, 938, a brown. Uh, three bags of 3776. We got a bag of 3755. And again, I'm looking at these drills, very flat backs, not a dimple on them. 518, three bags of that beautiful blue. I'm thinking that may go, well, I know, it'll, it'll either go in the mountains or the sky. 890, a dark, dark green. 762, two bags. It's a very, very light, light gray. 
All right, that's your first train. Next train to Georgia. Let's see what we got. Make a note of this. Um, I'm holding these drills right side up um, for the first time in a long time, so just write that down. <laughs> 517, two bags of this beautiful blue. We got two bags of 400, beautiful caramely brown. 3371, dark, dark, dark ooh, gray color. It almost looks like a 310, but it's not. Two bags of 301, more of that tannish caramely, um, you know, kind of a cross between a brown and a terracotta. 898, a brown. 120, ding, 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 ring the AB bell. This is another AB. Is that not absolutely gorgeous? I absolutely love these AB drills. That's a fantastic color. That's again gonna go in the sky or those mountains. 597, which is another really pretty color. 3865, a white. 3818, look at that gorgeous green. Oh, I love these colors. 3799, very dark gray. 3752, a light powder blue. 502, wow. This is an interesting color. I don't think I've seen this one before. It is a light ugh, greenish, bluish, grayish color. 413, dark gray. 741, a beautiful yellow. Not too much to write home about in these old bags. 3861, kind of a purpley taupe. And 742, a beautiful yellow. All right, next train to Georgia. We've got, well, let me do this one because it's a shorter the shorter bag. All right, 300, beautiful brown. Four bags of 807, a beautiful blue. God, these blues are gonna kill me. 310, not many 310s, guys. 310 is black for those of you unfamiliar. Not much of it, you normally get a lot. 839, another beautiful brown. All right, last train to Georgia. These are the babies. 3765, beautiful blue. 838, a dark, dark brown. 415, beautiful gray. 3808, would you look at that dark, deep turquoise? Wow, I wonder where that one goes. That's beautiful. 159, a beautiful lavender. Ding, 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 ring the AB bell. Here's your next AB, 138. Look at that beautiful blue. I'm thinking that's gotta go in the sky or the mountains, guys. We'll look and see where these ABs go. 3766. 844, another grayish brown. 904, another beautiful green. 3814, another deep turquoisey blue. Uh, 535, dark, dark gray. Ding, ding, ding. Next two are gonna be ABs. This is kind of a, a gunmetal or a steel gray. Look at that coating, but shim, shim, shimmy, shimmering. 134, beautiful green, AB. So you got two ABs in a row. Oh those, oh, those colors are killing me. All right, 37.90, um, a very, very light, uh, kind of a taupey brown. 30.42, a light mauve. 9.77, 6.40, kind of an army greenish khaki. 9.06, that's a beautiful green. And last but not least, 3.18, this is a, again, another purplish taupey color. So, ah, oh, these colors, they're gonna be awesome. All right, let's turn this bad boy back over and check it out. All right, I want to see, and in true care of fashion, no matter where I am, the uh, everything's falling on the floor. So, again, uh, for your AB colors, you've got one is one, two is two, three is three, four is four, and five is five. So that should not be uh, hard to discern. All right, we're going to look for the ones, and the ones are look to be a tan color. I'm looking for ones. Looking, looking, looking. Okay, so here we go. The ones, can they see this? Uh -huh. The ones are all gonna be in the legs of your horse. Any other? Ones are gonna be up here in this hill outlining it. Ones over here in some of the grasses or the, looks to be wheat, but I'm not sure. Uh, in the grasses, ones are gonna be all in the glints of these trees, all up here. All of those are your ones. I don't see any. Oh, one's here outlining the horses behind. Uh, 
Any other ones? I don't see any others. All right, let's look for the twos. Twos are blue. You know where those are gonna go. They're gonna go up here. Let me see. Sorry, they're vacuuming. Okay, two, all of this is two, all up here in the sky. Oh my gosh, tons of two, all in here. Those are all twos. Let me look up higher. I don't see any up higher in the sky. Do I see any in the mountains? No, I don't. So the twos are all gonna be in this sky here. Three is three, that's gonna be your green. Only a few places that can go. Okay, your threes are gonna be in these trees. It's gonna be sprinkled throughout these trees to just make them sparkle and shine all in here. Um, I don't see any threes over here and the trees in the background. Four is four, another blue. So let's look for these fours. I'm looking for any fours in these mountains. I don't see any fours in these mountains. Where are the fours? Okay, I see lots of twos. Where are my fours? Four, four, four. Sorry again for the vacuuming noise. Okay, so here are your fours. Your fours are gonna be all in here by the mountain, over here by the mountain. And I think that's it. We didn't get many fours, so I think those are gonna be, oh, no, no, no. We've got fours all up in here, all on the top. Those are all fours. So you're gonna have a lot of ABs in this bad boy. Any over here? No, I don't see any over there. Okay, so those are where your fours are gonna go and five is five. That is that gunmetal gray color. Okay, you're gonna have fives all in these mountains. That's where the fives are gonna go, all in this mountain um, to, help it, to help it sparkle. Any in the horse, I'm looking for fives in the horse. Yep, there's some up here in the horse's head uh five down here uh, a little bit by the horse's mouth i don't see any other fives that i can see so that's where those fives are going i'm looking over here to see if there are any fives in the clouds i don't see any all right so that is where your a b's are going to go guys you need to get on there and grab this one tomorrow it is absolutely beautiful if you are a nature a mountain or a horse lover or even if you're you're not. I mean, this is absolutely beautiful. I love the look on the horse's face. I love the fact that, you know, he's kind of wandered off from his herd and the title of this is Freedom and it is by Kim Penner. Um, again, schematics, lower right, upper left. Uh, you do have a thumbnail down at the bottom so you can see what that is. They just don't put the thumbnail with the schematics, which doesn't really mean anything, um, but it is on there. All right, Marlon, will you take the camera off the tripod and pan over this absolutely beautiful image? I want them to see the whole thing. Is that not majestic and peaceful? The look on the horse's face is amazing. You've got his horse herd here in the distance and the mountains and the trees. I absolutely am in love with this image. It's beautiful. I have not, I don't know if Kim Penner is a new artist to Diamond Art Club. I have not heard of her work on Diamond Art Club, but I could be wrong. If you know about anything about Kim Penner, um, or if she's done any art for Diamond Art Club, please list that below in the comments. I'd greatly appreciate it. Is that not beautiful? I, I'm in love with this image. I really, really am. So again, tomorrow, 9 o'clock Pacific, 12 o'clock Eastern for Diamond and Ruby members, 9.30 Pacific, 12.30 Eastern Standard for uh, general release. Go grab this one tomorrow, guys. I Again, I'm in, I'm in love with this image for many, many reasons. I love the title, Freedom. Um, also, if you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up. And also, if you're new to my channel, please consider hitting that subscribe button. Both of those things are free ways to help my channel, and I greatly appreciate it. And uh, I hope you've loved this sneak peek. Again, Diamond Art Club, you've outdone yourself. Kim Penner, thank you for this gorgeous image, and I will leave you like I always leave you in a world where you can be anything. Be kind. This is the Principal Painter, and I am signing off.